Hello, my name is Edgar. Core by Premiere Software has the ability to schedule classes and group sessions via its group activities function. Therefore, in this video, I will show you how to set up new group bookings as well as how to book them using Core. First, log into Core's configuration application if you are a single site business or administrator if you're based across multiple sites. Please note that there are some slight differences on the main screen between configuration and administrator as we will be using the latter of these two in this example. Once logged in, head to the appointments menu and click the group activities menu. This will produce a new window showing group activity codes, group activity timetables and group activity timetable amendments. To start creating a new group activity, click the group activity codes icon. On the next screen, you will be presented with any existing group activity codes that you may have already set up. Click the green plus to get started. You will now be able to input a code for your new group activity. For example, if you wish to set up an activity for yoga, input a short but recognisable code here, such as eYoga in this example. Your core system will use this code to recognise the activity. Below you can then input the full name of the activity in the description box. Below, make sure to use the Income Center drop-down menu to select the area you wish payments for the activity to go to, such as classes or perhaps leisure service. We go more in depth on the breakdowns of income centers and business areas in our financials video. You can then assign the current category using the drop-down menu below, such as facility. To the right of this, ensure you select the gender for the group activity. For example, you may wish to limit this to a specific gender for a swimming session, such as female, male, or either. The last option may be the best to select for any other gender for now. Next, you can allocate the sites that the activity will take place at. Click to highlight each applicable site, then press the single right arrow to allocate it. Do this for as many sites as appropriate. If you wish to allocate all available sites, you can click the double right arrow button. Once you are happy with the details, click the green tick. You can then click the back arrow as you will need to set up a group activity timetable. Click this icon to start the process. On the next window, click the green plus. You will then be able to select the relevant group code from the drop down menu, which in this case will be eYoga. This will then pull through the applicable group activity details. You can then use the day drop down menu to select the appropriate day that you would like to set parameters for. For example, you may wish for this yoga session to be available on Monday with the start time from 8.30 to the end time of 9.30 a.m. Below, set the maximum group size that this class or group activity can accommodate. You can also assign a waiting list size in the field, enabling a waiting list of clients should the group size be full. Next, set which member of staff will be taking this class. This is important if the member of staff earns commission for classes that they run. Moving to the right, set the start date that the activity is set to start on if this is a new activity. Similarly, if you have a final end date in mind, you can use the drop down arrow to select the applicable date from the calendar. If the class is ongoing, leave this blank. Finally, you can select the max online bookings per client. This will set the maximum number of people that can be booked for that class under one booking. For example, four would mean you limit the number of bookings to four for one client. We go more into detail for this in our group bookings for group activities and facilities video. Click the green tick to save the activity details. If you are using group activities to schedule meals for your clients, then you'll need to create a timetable for each sitting. You may wish to have a breakfast or lunch sitting in half hourly intervals, for example. Click the back arrow when you are done. Should you need to amend any timetables for specific occasions, click the group timetable amendments icon. Here you can amend the start and end times, the maximum group size, or even suspend the activity. For more details, make sure to watch our editing group activity timetables video. Click the back arrow once you are ready. Clients can now book group activities with your team through your reception menu and through the group activities icon. Select the site the client wishes to book for if you are based across multiple sites, then use the calendar to select the appropriate date. A particularly useful feature as of core version 2.13 is that the group activities are filtered by categories. Using the categories drop down menu, you can select which category the group activity belongs to. This will help filter the activities the client wishes to book as opposed to having them all in one list. 
Once selected, click to highlight the group activity to the left, including the time slot. Below, you will be able to see how many time slots are available for that class. Click one of these numbers to then bring up a screen for client details. Here, use the search field and method to locate the client in question, such as the surname. Click the applicable client from the list that appears at the bottom of the screen, including any booking information notifications, then press the green tick to finalize the booking. You can then click the Arrivals button at the bottom of the Group Activity screen to arrive clients as usual on the day, as well as use the Departures button to depart clients and bill them as appropriate. If you have yet to experience Core by Premier Software, want to book a free presentation using the link in our video description on YouTube, or visit our website at www.premier-core.com. Alternatively, you can find out more about Core when you telephone our sales team on plus 440-1543-466-580, or email us at sales at premiersoftware.co.uk. Why not subscribe to us on YouTube for weekly videos on how to use Core and click the notification bell to receive updates as soon as they become available. You can also follow us on Twitter at Core by Premier and LinkedIn at Premier Software Solutions for regular content. Take care and thank you for watching.